Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about Dinosaur Wrap and what makes this book special. So the first thing that makes this book really special is obviously the topic, dinosaurs, because kids love dinosaurs. And um, this really vibrant cover is something that grabs their attention as they walk by my booth, look on the website, page through the catalog. So it's just a really um, easy sell for me just in terms of judging a book by its cover. It's one of our best-selling sing-along books, so it's really fun to sing with. And one phrase that I use that really helps me sell this very quickly is when I tell customers that it helps kids get their wiggles out but they do it in their own spot. They're not messing with their neighbors. So they might be twirling, they might be tapping their feet, uh, a lot of different things to get some movement and help them burn off a little energy, but not get too crazy and rambunctious. So a fun fact about this book is that the, the man that sung it, sang it, excuse me, is Mikey Henry Jr. Now he is not only a world-class musician and a father, but he's also a social worker, which makes him very barefoot in so many different ways. And another fun fact for you, senior editor Kate De Palma and Mikey Henry sat down and actually listened to a whole bunch of 80s and 90s rap songs to figure out what would be the inspiration for the song. So if you happen to know which song or have any guesses on which song was the inspiration for the intro for this, definitely comment below for a little extra credit. So there is fantastic diversity in this book. This is something I didn't notice the first few times I even um, read it, watched it with my son. But if you just look at the different characters, you're going to see uh, different colors of skin. You're going to see different abilities. For example, one of the children has a hearing device, one has glasses, one uses a walker. You're going to see different skin colors. So I just love that it's built into the story um, that you're just, it's part of normal life to see children with um, different abilities and skin tones. So another neat thing is this artwork, I had no idea until I heard Debbie Harder speak, it's actually watercolor. I always thought of watercolor as being very soft and muted, but you can tell this is very vibrant and colorful. And then finally, one neat thing that really helps me sell this book is if you go to the end and you look at the end matter, you're going to get several pages of nonfiction notes. You're going to talk about um, the types of dinosaurs that are shown in the book. You're going to talk about where they lived, paleontology and digging up the bones. So one way that I really like selling a lot of these books that have this nonfiction end notes uh, or end matter is that these books grow with children. So you might get it when they're old enough just to look at the pictures or maybe enjoy the song, but as they get older and are ready for a little more information, you can use these nonfiction end notes to dig a little bit deeper. So uh, what would you add to this list about what makes this book special and ways that you can sell it? If you have something else to add, comment below so everyone else can see it and have a great day.